Hello friends, it's uh, Boris Legend here and today it's time for a short but uh, sweet tutorial here on my channel. Today I will show you how to move your goalkeeper in FIFA 18 and I'm not talking about rushing out. Far post finishes have been overpowered in uh, FIFA ever since last year when EA introduced this uh, new system where the goalkeeper covers the near post and leaves the far post wide open. But now there is a way to prevent this and it's actually very easy to perform. So first of all make sure to pick your goalkeeper assistance on automatic as this trick seems less responsive using goalkeepers on semi. And then all you have to do is to press and hold down the R3 button. When you start pressing it you will see your goalkeeper moving over to cover the far post. So press your right stick down until you hear a clicking sound and keep holding it down. And the more you hold R3 down the more the goalkeeper will move up to a certain distance and be careful so that you don't leave the near post wide open. This trick will work less good against the AI since it registers all your movements and of course it will finish in the near post. But when you play online in for champions against a human player, this trick can be the difference from winning or losing. We're gonna take a look at some in-game examples to show you the power of this move. You can see here Buffon, he has uh, this uh, far post uh, wide open, there's a big space to shoot. But we just uh, press down the right stick and keep holding it down and you will see how he moves over and just uh, completely closes this angle and makes an easy save. And you will see here another example from Grisou having a free run and you will see how much the goalkeeper actually moves. We have this uh, FIFA 17 reflex, we want to go for the far post but uh, now we can prevent uh, these easy goals just uh, pressing down R3 and you will see how much the goalkeeper actually moves and completely closes down the angle. Time for Lukaku, free run and it looks like the goalkeeper doesn't move but if you look here at the replay you can see how much he actually changes this by stepping two steps to the right and uh, preventing Pogba from scoring this goal. So now we actually have a way to stop uh, these uh, easy goals in the four post by just uh, pressing and holding down the right stick. And here we have uh, Iguain. you can see here this replay how much the goalkeeper actually moves. Here we press down R3 maximum and it also leaves the near post open but we know that he will go for the far post and we completely close down his angle and we can also use this for long shots. You will see here how we try to go for the finesse shot in the far post. It is uh, wide open here but as we start pressing down R3 you will see how Courtois will completely move over to the other side and uh, close down the angle. There is no chance that he can score in the far post when he's positioning it like this. But you also have to be careful because the more you press R3 the more the goalkeeper will move over and leave the near post wide open and if you play against a skilled opponent he will take advantage of this. This trick simply creates a great mind game between the attacker and the goalkeeper. If you enjoyed today's amazing trick then make sure to drop a like and also subscribe for some more content and we will have more tutorial coming to the channels. We have it defending, crossing, shooting and so on and these ones will come when I get access to the online gameplay in about one two weeks. Anyways thank you so much for watching as always you know until next time.